of this robot competition, the students have about six weeks from start to finish to design, construct a robot uh, based on a pretty stringent set of rules given up by a group called US First. And there are approximately 1,500 teams, uh, I'd say worldwide, about 40 regional competitions. And at those regional competitions, there's about 30 to 60 teams at each one. And at those competitions, what happens is they team up. We built one robot. We will team up with uh, two other teams from other places and go against three others. So it's a three-on-three -three robot competition. And this year, the game was basically playing soccer. By the end of 10 rounds, they try to figure out ratings. They call them seedings to figure out who's the best robot and who's not, you know. And we ended up being seated fifth out of 33. The weight limit was 120 pounds or less, and we made that one just fine. The overall official length was 38 inches long, 28 inches wide, and 60 inches tall, and everything worked out good, but we had to really pay attention to that. And other design considerations, we had to discuss if we wanted to do four-wheel drive, which we did, and then how we wanted to steer the thing. Then the other design aspect was how in the world are we gonna kick this soccer ball? And that was the hardest part. We had two teams of kids that worked on designing the soccer kicker. And we chose one design after we had some prototypes and went with it and it actually worked really well. We ran into so many problems with the robot. And it, we just kind of, every time we had to think, put our heads together and think ways, creative ways to fix it. And we kind of um, jerry-rigged a bunch of little fixes between matches and things. And yeah, just kind of, facing a problem and trying to fix it with little resources and time. These are future engineers, scientists, mathematicians, people who work with technology, computer programming, stuff like that. So they learn a lot, but most importantly, they learn teamwork and people skills. You don't care how you did because just the fact that you could build something and have this experience, you it's really more rewarding than any victory could have ever been.